This is my May 2021 empties. I have products here that I like, products here that I don't like. First, starting off with the Dove Exfoliating Body Polish. This is pomegranate seed, shea butter. This is supposed to be a moderate exfoliant. Overall, they don't use real pomegranate seeds. They use powdered pomegranate seeds to make this. Overall, I really like this. This leaves my skin feeling nice and smooth. This has a light scent to it. So when I put my nose to it, I can smell it. But when I'm using this in the shower, it's, I mean, you, it's really hard to smell in the shower. Next, I have the Gold Bond Ultimate Body Powder. The scent is Aloe Chamomile. I'm not really here for the scent. Next, I have the Nivea Nourishing Body Wash. This is really silky. It's very um, oily. It leaves your skin, uh, skin feeling nice and hydrated. I like this. This is a good uh, body wash. I like it. It has that signature Nivea scent. Next, I'm going to be talking about four products, starting with the Sleep Body Scrub. Packaging is interesting. Overall, this body scrub, this definitely leaves my skin feeling nice and soft and silky, but the exfoliant in this is little to none and it has this really weird texture to it i don't really like this body scrub but it does leave your skin feeling nice and soft because of the oils that are in here smells like baby powder but i would just mix the dove soap with this to help the exfoliant since the exfoliant is little to nothing in here. Next case! Next I have the Lavender Chamomile Sleep Body Butter. It's not nourishing, it's not hydrating. I don't like the texture, the consistency to this. It's just something about this. Smells like floral baby powder. Next I have the sleep spray. I like this mister. The product comes out really nice and gentle and I like the mister. But it smells like floral baby powder. Sleep body wash, same thing. Overall, when it comes to all these products, they all smell like floral baby powder. I think they need to go back to the lab and get the fragrance together. Lavender chamomile. Next, I have the St. Ives Oatmeal and Shea Butter. This costs $3 and it has a nice comforting smell. Next, I have the Jergens Deep Restoring Argan Infused Body Wash. This smells like hair shampoo. Personally, I'm not here for the smell. Neutrogena Liquid Facial Cleanser. I talk about this often. I think Neutrogena has a lot of intense products. Uh, this is one that's more simple. It's nice. It's, uh, it's good for sensitive skin, and I like this. Uh, this is good on my hair when I'm just trying to simply comb through it. That's it for my May 2021 empties.